Hey guys, I've got a quick one for you today. We're going to be checking out an app called Locket. It's been re-released and it's in the process of getting redesigned, so I thought I'd give it another look. Basically, it allows you to lock specific apps. So if you don't want someone accessing your photos in your gallery or Facebook raping you, you can use this app to lock it with a password or pattern. So yeah, let's check it out. Now this app is very simple to use. At the top you've got a star which is a quick link to the pro version. I'm currently using the free version so some features are off limits to me. The next icon allows you to add applications to lock. And then you have the settings. You can turn off animations, you can lock the package installer so if someone tries to uninstall the app they would first have to enter the password. Underneath that you have timeout and chain security. You have the options for either password or pattern. And lastly you have some pro options including stealth mode and scheduled lock. Now to add an application it's as simple as pressing the plus button. We'll try an application here, we'll just try Android Central and then you need to go ahead and press the padlock to make sure it's locked and that's it. It's now going to require a passcode to enter Android Central. You can see it comes up for a second and then this passcode comes up and uh, if you get it wrong you'll see nothing happens, you just can't actually enter the application until you get it right. Of course if it times out the application will shut as well. If you try and get into it through the recents again it's going to bring up the passcode so you can't get into it that way and if you press back it will just go ahead and shut everything. Now it should be noted that in the free version you can only have a limit of three applications so you can't have more than that. If you do try you'll see a toast that says the free version is limited to three applications so if you want more than that you will have to go ahead and get the premium version. Now I'm sure a lot of you are wondering how is the overall security of this application. Well firstly if you try to get into the Locket app you will need to input the password or you know pattern that you set so you can't just go ahead and turn it off. If you try to uninstall the application for example from the app drawer you'll see that again you're prompted with the pattern unlock so you'll have to know that to uninstall it. The application does ask for device administrator rights so if you try to uninstall it through the settings menu you can see that both the force close uninstall and clear data are not allowed to be touched they're all greyed out so you can't just clear the data. Um, of course you could go into the settings and actually turn off it being a device administrator so the best way to keep secure with this application is to actually add the settings app to lock it so if someone tries to access your settings now they're going to be greeted with a password or pattern and they're not going to be able to uncheck the device administrator for the application and therefore they're not going to be able to uninstall the application. Now I'm not saying this application is 100% secure from things like ADB or Fastboot but it's definitely going to stop the average user from getting to your Facebook status or certain applications that you don't want them to see. So yeah it's pretty cool guys let me know what you think of it. Peace out.